Hi, this is Lee Benz, the home scholar. I have to say, as I'm standing here in my yard, I'm completely distracted by it. the smell of my lilacs. It's just amazing. So if I have a huge sigh in the middle of this presentation, you will know it is just because, oh my goodness, these lilacs are wonderful. Um, but what I really wanted to talk to you about uh, was how to graduate your homeschooler with college credit. Okay, um, if you can have your child graduate homeschool with college credits, that can save money on college because if they already have some credits racked up, they're not gonna have to take those in college and so it can shorten the amount of time that they have in college. My own children homeschooled college for um, one year of college credit, which um, could shorten their college down to just three years. They also, my children also had one year of college credit with community college. Um, and so that could have again shortened down their um, college experience to just another year. Um, so when my children started college, they really could have gotten through it in two years. Um, however, big caveat, um, one of my kids is an engineer and you really can't speed up engineering no matter what you do, no matter how many college credits you have before you start at the university level, it still takes four years. Um, so when you're thinking about college credits, you wanna be thinking about uh, their ultimate goals in life and, um, and their college major because it may not um, help you as much as you're thinking that it's going to. So if you have a child that's interested in um, any medical or engineering field, it probably isn't going to shorten the amount of time that they spend in college. Another thing to think about is that there are kind of three different ways um, to accumulate college credits. And one is through testing using AP, another one is testing using CLEP, and another one is taking community college classes. Each one of those has drawbacks to it, and not all colleges will take all three of those ways. Some colleges will take just one way or two ways, but not the third way. Um, and the other thing is there's plenty of colleges out there where you can come to college with college credit, but they're not gonna give you any credit for your college credit. <laughs> um, so for example, uh, one of the Ivy League schools will say no matter how many college credits you have through um, community college, they're just flat out not gonna give you credit for it. Um, when that happens, um, having college credits may strengthen your admission package. It may make your student more desirable. Uh, it may demonstrate the rigorous nature of your homeschool and how they're ready to go for college. Uh, but it's not necessarily gonna make college go faster or make your child get out of college quicker. And it may not necessarily uh, be accepted by the college that your child chooses to go to even though they do look at your child and think, oh, they must be pretty smart. Um, so I hope that helps. I, um, I do have lots of material on how to homeschool college on my website, thehomescholar.com, and you'll find more information there. I also have helpful classes on my other website, homeschoolthroughhighschool.com. I hope that helps.